Beating in a busy center city mall has raised concerns. Right now, police are working to track down the suspects behind this attack that comes during one of the busiest times of the year for people who are out at the mall. Action News reporter Jacqueline Lee is live now at police headquarters with a closer look at the investigation that's now underway, Jacqueline. That's right, Shari. Police obviously don't want this to happen again, especially as people are buying those holiday gifts. Shoppers we spoke with say they're not going to let crime deter them from going out. Take a look at this video and these images showing three teen suspects wanted in an attempted armed robbery. Police allege the three suspects attacked a 70 year old man as he was walking into the ground level bathroom at the Fashion District Mall in Center City. That's crazy. I just would have never expected that. Usually there's like a lot of security down there, so that's kind of like alarming to hear. Officials say it happened around 1 25 on Thursday afternoon, December 2nd. They allege one of the suspects showed a gun. When the victim said he didn't have any money, the three suspects proceeded to punch the victim in the head and face. It's sad, you know, because it's supposed to be a, a, a city of brotherly love. The attack comes as the city is in the thick of holiday shopping with Christmas Village in full swing. I like the, the feeling of, of the city. Um, the liveliness of it. According to our 6 ABC data journalism team, robberies involving a firearm in this area of the 6th district, which includes the fashion district, have gone up significantly since 2019. There were five armed robberies in this section year to date in 2019. This year it jumped to 28. Shoppers say the crime isn't phasing them. I think it's something where you just be taking proper precautions, be alert, don't look at your phone. You know, you can't worry about it. Wherever you go, it's just there. We cannot affect your time with the holiday. It brings everyone together. So, it cannot affect you. And police say they did not make any arrests at this point in time. We did reach out to the Fashion District. A spokesperson said no comment. We are live outside police headquarters. Jacqueline Lee, Channel 6 Action News. Shari.